and shop local by UP. We continue taking a look at the impacts of this historically warm winter on UP businesses. Yeah, TV6's Clint McLeod speaks to two southern UP businesses about how they are overcoming struggles, what hope lies ahead. Agoa Rentals in Manistique is missing its usual snowmobile engine buzz this time of year. The rental store has 10 snowmobiles available for rent, and staff say they are operating at a heavy loss. We had to tighten the belt a little bit and cut back where we could cut back. Um, but we really uh, have been trying to advertise more, get our name out there. There are currently zero snowmobiles out for rent, and that there were only a handful of completed rentals all season. Pretty sad, actually. Um, definitely handed out more refunds than we did rentals. Another business in the southern UP impacted by a mild winter is the NEMA Inn in Delta County. Owner Charlie McIntosh says this was supposed to be the first year a snowmobile trail passed through NEMA. The business owner says he lost thousands of dollars in reservations and restaurant sales. I did make some investments for this trail coming down, which turned out to be a flop for me this winter. So um, hopefully next year we can make it up because, yep, other than that, you got to go to the bank and get another loan. McIntosh has owned the inn for 16 years. He says this year was the first year he had to take out a loan to make it through the winter. Despite now being in debt, he expects a successful summer will allow him to pay back the loan this year. So far, I think I got about a dozen musical events coming up. Um, uh, musicians, I get travel all from all over the world and stuff. Uh, we're a destination for music now, for live music. But both businesses say you can support them this spring and summer. The NEMA Inn says it has 17 rooms for rent along the Lake Michigan shoreline for a quiet getaway. Meanwhile, Agua Rentals says you can make reservations now for ORV rentals to hit the trails this summer. Clint McLeod, TV6 News.